Hello Sagittarius, this is Sue from Sweet Love Tarot and I am doing that uh, suggestion uh, from one of my uh, subscribers, a Sagittarius, uh, to do something on long distance relationships. So in order that I could uh, expand on this a little bit, um, this will be not only a physical distance, but it could, would also work for those who feel an emotional distance. So uh, this is for July. Sagittarius. Thank you for the suggestion. Okay. This is a deck that doesn't have any court cards and you don't read any of them in the uh, reverse. So um, what I'm going to do is lay them out and have three cards to represent your energy, three cards that represents your partner's energy, and then um, if there's a reason for the distance, uh, if there's a spiritual reason, uh, any um, steps that could be taken to bring this closer together, and the outcome. So, let's see. A lot of major arcana here, um, but for you on your side, um, I'm seeing new love. Uh, it's it's a beginning, uh, and also I see that you have perhaps some unrealistic ideas in your head about um, where this might go. Uh, but you also, um, you also have the energy of hope, wishing, and you know, the, this, this card is, can also be um, perceived as wishful thinking, maybe unrealistic thinking. Um, uh, it says to choose wisely. Love begins, choose wisely, and you have hope uh, and healing. Interesting combination. Um, your partner has uh, a balance, a fairness, um, and, uh, and they also have patience, and again with the fairness, <laughs> again with the fairness, uh, oh, and um, they're also very creative. Uh, they're the kind of person that ideas just sort of flow. Um, uh, so, and it could be any kind of thing. Uh, uh, musically, uh, art. Uh, it could even be creativity as in creating a child. Um, so, interesting. Um... <laughs> The reason for the distance uh, it says uh, I've got solitude here. Um, okay, so one or perhaps both of you are going through a period where you feel the need to do some soul searching. You're looking within. Um, you have suffered an emotional loss, but what this tells me is that you also have to put that behind you. You have something in front of you uh, that is uh, worth noticing, uh, but perhaps, uh, perhaps both of you are more focused on the past and what you've lost than what you still have. And um, so perhaps what you need to do is be grateful for what you have and recognize that there's something there. You. Soul searching is not a bad thing either. I mean, if, you, if you're searching for answers, the best place to look is within. Um, and realize you can't focus on what's already gone. You can't focus on what's lost. You need to focus on what's coming. And this, this is kind of amazing over here with, with um, balance. 
uh, and like rebirth, possibility of birth. Uh, in any event, it's cr creativity. Um, it, it could be fertile with ideas too. So I mean, it's it's a um, it's fertility in the broadest sense. Um, but what I'm seeing is is neither one of you are content. You you seem to be bored. Um, this separation is creating, you're, you're not able to share your hope and your healing and your creative ideas and your fairness. Um, this pair is separate. I'm going to say m more than It doesn't seem to me like you've, um, like you're putting it together right now. So July doesn't look like a very good month for Sagittarius. I'm sorry to say, I don't see, I don't see like a breakup, but I'm seeing a choice that needs to be made. In the one case, um, there's too much focus on what's lost and no focus on what is what remains or what what can go from here. And there's also a feeling of boredom and discontent. Um, I want to pull uh, a one card. Oh, let's see. Let's do it this way. Okay. Let yourself sparkle and shine. Um, that might be that may be the best thing for you to do. It certainly will make you feel good, uh, and at the and it may make this partner of yours uh, take notice. So uh, you're guided to be bold and show you're bigger than life. Um, show that to the whole world. Uh, <laughs> if you're just showing it to him, it's like nanny nanny boo boo. So show it to the world. And then he's going to take notice. At any rate, that's what I have for you, Sagittarius. Uh, if any of you have a, a reading that you'd like to see, if you have a suggestion, uh, drop it in the comment section. Uh, I'll take a look and see if I can do it between my uh, love readings. Uh, love readings are next, so um, join me for those too. Bye-bye.